So to answer the question, are boas better than ball pythons? What's up? Man, I'm happy to be back. It's been super busy around here lately, but I'm here to answer a question or maybe give my opinion. Are boas better than ball pythons? Well, it depends on what you're trying to do, I guess. I have a bunch of various species, well, not a bunch, but to me, boas are the most beautiful reptile on the planet. And then after that, it would be hognose and then ball pythons. Boas take a little bit of extra work to get breeding. I've never bred them. But let me show you some updates on three of the boas I currently own. So this is my female, Tara Humara. This is a boa sigma from the Tara Humara locality. She is super beautiful. And I got her from Chris at BNS Reptilia. She's getting pretty big. And here is my male. I really like the way the male looks. Got a lot more contrast. Super cool. I also got him from Chris. And these are a small species or locality of boa. So I'm choosing to stay in the boa sigma species of boas. They are smaller. They're just really cool. And they have morphs so you can stay within the species. Still play around with morphs without making like hybrids and mutts and stuff like that. And this is a Sonoran boa that I got from Dr. Warren Booth himself. This is a hypo leopard. She got some really cool undertones of like pinkish orange. She's my favorite one personality wise. She's real inquisitive, super chill. Look at those eyes on her. Look at that cool tail. I can't wait to breed her at some point. So to answer the question, are boas better than ball pythons? I don't even really think that should be a question. Honestly, they both have pros and cons. Boas are extremely good looking, love their head structure. Part of the pros with them is you kind of like food cycle them. So like when I put my hog nose down for brumation, I stop feeding the boas for that 10 weeks or whatever it is too. You can go longer. So they're not like a year round maintenance like ball pythons. My ball pythons pretty much eat and breed year round. So I mean, it is all year long with the ball pythons. Ball pythons uh, have a lot more morphs. Uh, they're like super chill. Boas show like more intelligence. They're inquisitive. I only have three, but they definitely, all three have their own personalities. So I guess it really depends on what you're looking for. I know boas are gonna have a longer turnaround time in the sense of like, you buy them, you're not gonna be breeding them in a year and a half, two years, more than likely, unless you're power feeding them and stuff. And I'm not gonna power feed them. You know, I feed them uh, according to Dr. Warren Booth and Jessica Hare from Hare Hollow Farms. And you know, I feed them healthy, but I'm not power feeding them or over feeding them. And I do give them that break in the winter where they're not getting fed at all. So try to simulate a little bit of what they would go through in the wild. Not, obviously not as extreme, but you know, I'm a novice keeper, especially when it comes to boas. And I look at everything from a ball python lens. So there's that. But anyways, while the ball python market's down, why don't you guys diversify a little bit and get a ones and twos of other animals and see what you like, man. I've been keeping multiple species since day one. It helps keep me sane, keeps me occupied when there's natural lulls in some of the other species. I'm busy with other things and it's just fun. This is a reptile hobby, so I'm enjoying keeping a variety of species and I definitely have my favorites that I'm drawn to, you know, ball pythons and hognose, everyone knows that. But I've also been, you know, raising these boas nice and slow in the background too. So I'm looking forward to one of these years breeding them. And while we're speaking of boas, I'm trying to buy another boa. So anyone that sees this video, hit me up on the morph market. 
uh, on the Morph Market ads, and I'll hook you up on a discount. I'm trying to get a little bit more money together so I can buy a boa. So let's wheel and deal. I got ball pythons for sale, and I'm going to be listing more today. While this video is dropping, I'll be listing more. So let's deal. Until next time, guys, rock on.